you're a chosen daughter. You, you, we chose you. And, and they just were telling me and describing that they wanted me and that I, you know, they loved me and that, um, I was born in this far away foreign place <laughs> called Colombia. And, um, yeah, that was kind of how I was told. I was very proud of it. Like, I remember later when I was around fourth grade going into my class and it was show and tell and I wanted to show and tell everybody that I was adopted. And um, it wasn't received <laughs> as excited as I was about it. And so something that was kind of told to me as a special thing, it just got flipped around. You know, parents who put some context around this idea that you're with them because, you know, your, your family couldn't take care of you. They're, they're, I get that grounding. I understand that. I, I just think we, we don't take it far enough sometimes mm -hmm. in terms of really explaining age appropriately to children what the, the why. And we, we like to put on top of this, this idea of you're chosen, you're special, you're lucky. And so here you are feeling like, yeah, I'm lucky. I, I, my parents told me this thing. I feel pretty good about it. I'm going to share it with everyone. And then boom, you get this reception of it that feels not good. For more of April's thoughts on adoption, identity, and family, go to aprildinwiddie.com.